So you guys have been together 17 years then? Yeah. Yeah. You seem to know each other's faults then. Oh, I do. Inside out. Can you open tell fucking girl? What, what's, <laughs> what's, what's his good points? Oh, he has a hell of a, a, hell of a lot. What, what like? He, he knows me inside out. I can, as soon as he opens my eyes in the morning, it, it, first thing he says, I love you, my girl. And no, do you want, do you want a cup of good points. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm talking about. Caring. Very outspoken. I like that about him, though. Mm. I love that I about him. I love what I say. No I what trouble it's called, as I say, yeah. And that's what... And it, it's not like other people, you know, people, but we, we just yeah, keep yeah, ourselves to ourselves. We don't, we don't have friends and associates. We just, we just us, we do our thing. We don't go conjugating with people. We just, and that's what I've always loved about him. You know, it's me and him, and that's all that matters. And he don't, nothing can enter that. And if anyone tries to, that's when, they see a different Robin. It's so protective and so loyal and, you know, I could never ask for a more loyal and considerate, you know, and, and well protective partner. It must be hard as a couple though, you know, being homeless though. I mean... It's well, been a struggle well, for him it, and I know it has. a pair of us. For, that from being, being a, a man. Walk, that's just a walk in the park. What from being a man. For? And a man normally feels like they have to be the breadwinner and have to do, do you know, get, get the home and be the homemaker. But for him not being on the street, being on the streets, I can see the frustration is and the you know the worry night after night when he's not slept properly and he's been sat up worrying about where tomorrow we're going to get money from to get through and where we can go and try and get some housing, how we're going to try and stay where we're sleeping at the church, you know, and because he's not not been sleeping properly, it, it gets him irritable and and then I get worrying about him and then that's when I start worrying, that's when he, he, he does get upset with himself. Don't get me wrong, love, right? The man come back with... Yeah, he's a criminal. Like, all, all he's ever done is a uh, crime. Yeah, don't get me wrong. I've got, hey, used to have a I've got 368 record. convictions. And what? I've but been in the last year? I've been to jail God knows how many times. But since you've moved to Hull? But I, since coming to Hull, I have not been in trouble. Once. I, I have not even been arrested in Hull once, right? So I'm just bringing this up because and if Carl and Vineyard tried coming back yeah, with, well, he's a criminal, it, well, it's okay. Back, and go I'm back a year ago and you could guarantee he'd be arrested within a month, twice a month. I'd be some, if, if, he'd, if, he was gone, if he was gone more than three hours and I didn't, I had nowhere to find him, I'd just go on the police station, I'd never be locked up. And I could always guarantee... His first, when when things go wrong, his first thought, crime. But now, since we've come to all and we fresh start, I've seen the truth, my, my Rob, when I first got with him, he's not committed one, one crime, he's not even thought about it. And his first thought is me now, where before it wouldn't, he wouldn't think about me, wouldn't think of the consequence, where now he does. And that's a lot for him and for him to to change like he has it, 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 you know it's a big thing for him and, and I, I'm proud of him ever so proud of him you know it, it, it's a big achievement for him